Hi guys, today I've got a really exciting kit to show you and it's the newest learning resources number block set, the Math Links Cubes. Now you will remember that we reviewed number one to number 10 a while ago. And if you don't remember, then I have provided a link here so you can go and watch the first video set. And here is the new one. So now we've got 11 up to 20. And inside here we've got the stickers. You might remember these from last time. You have a guide on how to use these with your children. Everything is in here, lots of suggestions how to build them. And then we've got these cool big cards and there's various activities that you can do with these. So I'm gonna show you them on both sides to see what they look like. And they're really high quality. They're kind of a shiny, very durable material. And all the pictures are super clear. And you can look at all the different ways that you can build the numbers. And it's also good for counting, early maths, kind of thing. So showing you both sides of these. I like how each of the cards are numbered on the different sides to correspond with a different activity. So for example, this is number 12, and then this is number 10. So they're really bright and colorful cards and different scenes from the series. Another thing you can do with these cards is just to place the bricks on top of them. And then we've also got these small cards, so there's plenty to do. And here we've got all our different number blocks from 11 to 20. Very good for counting. Because you've got the number line there across the bottom as well as a reference and different ways that we can get to our numbers. Oh, we've got number 15, the step squad. It also shows on the back there how the different numbers can look in their different configurations. And now let's have a look at the cubes. So you have everything you need in this kit to make the numbers from 11 up until 20. You can also use them, of course, in your whatever way that you want. <laughs> and if you have the first set, they're even better because you can have all the little pieces, all the characters together so far. So I'm just looking for the piece of paper, here it is, and this is the reference on how to build them. Like I said, you can put them together in any way that you want, but I'm just going to follow the guide to, as we make up the figures. And with this one, you're going to put the math links cubes together, the correct amount, and then you've got the stickers, and you have these flat pieces there that you stick onto the front, and you can add the eyes and the faces onto there. So remember, because we're doing 11 to 20, we're gonna have our base 10 of white and then our colors on top of that, with the exception of 20, because we know 20 is that light orangey peachy color. So I'm just referring to my guide and they've also got the mini way of making these where you just use uh, two cubes and that's great for counting as well. And just playing with in general. Here you go, here's our number 12. Remember our yoga number block. I'm putting in the smooth blocks there and then adding the stickers. You remember that you can always remove those pieces if you want later on. I've got to show you, you also get a little whiteboard pen, which is really great. And you can use this to draw on the cards and it just rubs off really easily. 
they've given you lots of cool accessories. I mean, they did last time, but even more so this time. You'll see what I mean in a moment. And of course, we're at number 13 here. And adding on the stickers again, you've got the correct amount of stickers where you can do them, the characters with a uh, smaller face or you can make them as the bigger shape, which is what I'm doing right now. And then we'll put together number 14 using our guide. And we'll get the face pieces on here. Everything's very easy to find. And then how cool is this? This is too awesome. It's a skateboard. Oh my gosh, and it works. And not just that, but the helmet as well for number 14. These accessories are so cool. Let's add the numbering on as well. That's amazing. I don't know where else you would find accessories for MathLinks Cube than in these kits. And then I'll do number 50, which is the step squad. You could of course also do the step squad configuration. You can work that out like this. And then adding on the face there. And adding the numbering, which fits in perfectly on top of the MathLinks cubes. Then let's move on to number 16. Now the thing about MathLinks cubes, as I'm sure I've told you a million times before, the way that they click together, they don't fit two ways, just one. It's enough to get the shapes together, but they might not always hold together as tightly as you want, as you'll see with this one, for example. But that's just how MathLinks cubes are. It still looks pretty cool. And it just gives you that flexibility to move the pieces around and change the shape of them if you want. And now who is this? It's our 17. Remember the uh, double numbers like this? It's usually based on the original one to 10, but with the addition of the 10 white pieces. <gasps> How cute is this? 17 is an artist. And you even get the little ink splodges stickers to add, which is a really, really nice touch. Then we've got number 18. Looking really good. And then we're coming to number 19. And number 19 is one of those really interesting numbers because there's just so many different ways you can put the pieces together. And I love that they've put this attention to detail, which is including three different shades of gray rather than just um, giving you gray. So it just means you've got the extra detail there. I'm just adding on the face there. Number 19, of course, has those kind of twirly eyebrows, if you like. You can always, if you wanted the pieces to lie flatter, like what I used to do is use a little bit of uh, white tack or blue tack. And then finally, we're onto our number 20, and we've got these peachy colored ones, uh, MathLinks cubes for number 20. And look, for, look out for this. This is like the coolest accessory, as you'll see. We'll do number 20's face first. And 
and look at this the numbling on one side just turning that around the numbling has to go into a math links cube um where the part is sticking out and the top hat oh my goodness i can't believe number 20 has a top hat how cool is that and then we have these spare pieces here so what we can do is add on the faces to these pieces why not you don't have to do that um if you're not making them yet but i've decided to just so i've got them there to use later on and this is if you want to make kind of smaller pieces if you don't want to use up all your math links cubes from the set you can still make smaller versions of each of the numbers which is really cool so i'm gonna have to find my one to ten set and show you the whole thing together aren't i, I will do that don't worry so let me show you the finished pieces that we made from this brilliant set we have number 11 i think number 11 was our football fan right number 11 we have number 12 who likes yoga number 13 with a smiley face number 14 with his absolutely awesome skateboard and helmet i just love the accessories so much what a nice touch and then we've got number 15 our step squad friend number 16 a nice square number 17 who is an artist number 18 looking very happy number 19 with those lovely gray cubes and number 20 with the absolutely adorable top hat and the bow tie stickers as well so i hope you guys enjoyed that video it's an awesome set i will link to it in the comments a must i think for any number block fan I'll see you again next time. Don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye.